Binary Pals and welcome to today's video where we will be painting jeans. These two pairs of jeans are rather plain and they need to be spiced up. I'm a sucker for cool pants and sweatpants and jeans. The pants that I'm wearing literally have butterflies on them. Like, that's cool. I own a pair of sweatpants that are half and half and there's a cool dragon on it. I have US Marine pants. I, I like the cool pants and the pants that I see that have stitches in them or they look graffitied or they have flowers on them or something. I I eat those up. Those mm, crispy. I love those kind of jeans. So I have two pairs of very plain jeans that I am going to customize to make them so I actually want to wear them. Victim number one. Pair of American Eagle jeans. My sister gave them to me because they didn't fit her anymore, but they fit me perfectly. I don't typically wear these kind of jeans. I have another pair that are similar to this. They are not high-waisted, which I really like high-waisted, but these are not, so I have to motivate myself to actually wear high, not high-waisted pants. And also they're a little bit more tighter when I like the more wide leg, straight leg pants, but they are blue cut, sort of. They have a flare at the bottom, which I do like so anyway i don't wear these kind of jeans often but if i were to paint these to something that i like then probably i will wear them more often victim number two you know these ones these are my half and half bleached also american eagle jeans that i did in a past video um where i made the pants half and half one is lighter than the other and then the same on the back i have since grown since i bleached these and uh, they're more of capris now. I have to roll up the bottoms so they don't look weird. And I've lost my motivation to wear these jeans because I don't particularly like capris. <laughs> I like having my ankles covered, thanks. But I'm thinking if I spiced it up a bit, then maybe I'd actually want to wear these, these, these jeans again. So those are the two that I'm going to do in this video. The first one we're going to do is the non half and half one. We're going to do the half and half one. Like that one. Uh, this is the one I want to focus on. Ooh, that was loud. And my idea for this, I actually saw on Pinterest or Instagram. I think it was Pinterest. Give me a second. That's what I want to do. Obviously, I'm going to do my own spin on it, but that is what I want to do. These jeans are not black, so the lightning won't stand out as much as I probably would have liked it to. But it's fine. I'm going to do my own thing, and it's going to be great. I just got to figure out what exactly I want to do. Do I want to do a half and half thing like she did? Or do I want to do the, all of the jeans? Or do I want to do Lightning on one side and then something else on the other. What's the opposite of lightning? Water is the opposing element of lightning. I don't like that. We're gonna do lightning and fire because I feel like that would be good given that it's blue and red and those can contrast each other well. Wait, or do I actually want to use blue or do I want to use a different color? Do I want to use all the colors for the lightning? Speaking of blue fire, we did a science thing in science and she made blue fire. It was very cool. Maybe I should actually sketch out my idea first. Oh, I got it! I am a genius. I like that idea. So we're gonna set up. cardboard in there to hopefully help protect. I want it to kind of already match the- Hi Max! Max has joined me. I kind of want it to match this color just a little bit. Do I know exactly how to do that? No, I know I don't. But crack at it, I guess.
base of the lightning, I guess, done. And I'm going to switch my attention over to the other pant leg where I mentioned that I was going to make fire happen. And the thing with that is on, oh, it's sticking to the cardboard. On this pant leg, I had blue and then I ended up adding orange accents to it because I decided that on this pant leg where the fire is going to be, it's going to be orange fire with blue accents. And if you know your color theory, orange and blue are opposites of each other. So, okay, but like she cute. I'm excited to do the other side. I'm going to do what I did with the lightning and I'm going to do the, the spongy sponge sponge with orange. <laughs> I'm so good at describing things. So good. I did a little try on tester to see what I needed to do next and I decided that I needed a little bit more of the flickery flame bits up the knee so I started working on that and then working on the pockets. And here are the completed jeans. I am super happy with how these turned out. I think they're very cute and very unique and they genuinely just look cool. Alrighty, on to the second pair of jeans, which I've been procrastinating. This is the one that's gonna have kind of graffiti things going on because that's what I feel like doing. And yes, I did get a haircut. It's kind of a mess today, even though it's, yes, haircut, hair short. Anyway, moving on. Jeans already half bleached. And since this pant leg already got fun things going on, we're gonna do it on the non-bleached pant leg, the graffiti stuff. I have already kind of have a very, very messy sketch of what this is gonna look like, as you can very clearly see. It is not colored, although it probably should be, but it's fine. And so, yeah, I am not going to do the backside of this pant leg, although I probably will do it on the opposite pocket on the back side. So yeah, I need to put cardboard in here. I was gonna use black as like the first thing to use, but I don't have enough black to do that with. So we're gonna use brown instead, which is a bit interesting because I never use brown, but we're gonna try it. I'm scared, but we're just gonna go in. This might be a mistake. Can you tell I'm scared?
is all we have time for today. I hope you enjoyed this video and watching me paint some very cool jeans. I definitely will wear these jeans and have been wearing these jeans. I hope you enjoyed and have a fantabulous rest of your day. Bye!